Okay, I'm going to quickly show you what I did to replace the batteries in my electric razor or shaver or whatever. First off, just remove the back plate, two screws on mine. So I took them off and the back just pops right out. See so if you can see, there's really nothing in there. That's what's on the inside that counts here. So originally there were two nickel cadmium batteries. They have a little lead coming off the end that's just tack welded on there. And then the, um, the wire leads were then soldered into them. So what I did, I just removed them. You can see these just pop right out. And lay them off to the side. So I don't know if you can, well I hope you can see it, but this black lead runs from negative on this side to positive on this side and then pos or yeah that's right negative to positive and then your negative on this battery goes to the blue lead that leads into this uh, power supply board or uh, charging board and then out of the charging board is a positive lead going into the positive on this side well the way I hooked them together to where the leads would stay I just with some just some solder I got from the hardware store I just soldered a little bit of I put a little bit of solder on the um, battery terminal so this is on the negative side and see if we can get some to stay real quick There we go, that should be okay. We got a little bit to stay. And then I'm just gonna use a, a lead I have here as an example. Once you've got the solder on the terminal, the battery that you need it on, grab whatever wire it is you need soldered together. Um, let's see. Tin the end if it's not already tinned. If it is, go ahead and Stick her on there. I use my vice grips, and you'll see now that we've got a connection. So then you'll just you know do that to to all sides of your battery till it's all connected. Fit it back together inside your shaver exactly how it came apart make sure these leads are out of the way when you put it back together because that's where the screw hole has to go when I stuck mine back together I had to use it at, started at an angle there it is. and we'll give her a test before we screw it back together it's working So that's, just, that's all you need to do to replace the battery on your electric shaver. Save yourself, I don't know, anywhere from 30 to 150 bucks.